something real spectacular to get their attention. Yeah, there's Betty and Veronica down there. Boy, are they going to be impressed when they see my great high wire act. Hey, girls, look at me. What was that? I don't know. Having gained their attention, you can make a big impression on any girl by painting a really groovy portrait of her. This always works, especially when you're a great artist like me. Now, all I need is a frame. Another foolproof way of making a big hit with a girl is to serenade her, especially when you accompany yourself on ten different instruments, like I do. Yes, sir, there isn't a girl on earth who can resist metal, a moonlight melody maker. Yoo-hoo, it's your lucky night. Reggie's here. <laughs> popular with the girls, but remember, hey, don't overdo it. You might get a little pale in the face. <laughs> theater with quick, tricky gags. Yeah, see you later, Arch. I'm going out to water the lawn. But, Moose, it's raining. No, yeah. Th then I better put on a raincoat. <laughs> sure glad I wasn't born in France. How come? I can't speak French. <laughs> is crummy in any language. In there. Ooh, quick, where does it hurt? Right here. Oh, it's all in your head. Well, I have a photographic mind. Too bad it never 
never developed. <laughs> oh, I'll never forget the day I met Reggie. Though heaven knows I've tried. Do you have trouble making up your mind? Hmm, well, yes and no. Send him away. I'm too sick to see anyone. Presenting <laughs> the Thunderbolt Symphony. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Y you know what's dumb spelled backwards? Uh -uh. Mud. <laughs> Jay, what? <laughs> oh, I wish I was rich so I could disinherit him. <laughs> Shh. Ethel's taking a beauty nap. Okay, I'll come back in a couple of years. <laughs> Why did Humpty Dumpty have a great fall? Uh, to make up for a crummy tummy. Reginald, I'd like to go one whole day without having to school you. Okay, you have my permission. <laughs> hey, Chuck, let's eat up the block. No, I don't like concrete. <laughs> I nearly died laughing last night. Oh, really? Which one of your jokes were you telling? <laughs> Tell me, Coach, why is this stadium so cold? Because it has so many fans. <laughs> knock, knock. Who's there? Stan. Stan who? Stand aside, I'm coming through. <laughs> Funny, Doctor. What should I do? Go on television! Hey, Daddy, what time is it? It's two o'clock. That's funny. I've been asking that question all day, and I keep on getting different answers. <laughs> Let's join Miss Grundy and Mr. Wetterby at the high school gym. Just look at those horrible decorations. For once, I agree with you. In my day, we really knew how to fix up a hall. Well, I feel we owe the youngsters the benefit of our experience. You are so right. That looks great, Archie. Stand aside, children. Miss Grundy and I are taking over. But, but, tut, tut. Save your thanks for later. Miss Grundy, steady the ladder while I go up topside. Very well, but do be careful. <laughs> Don't let go. What you've done, you big klutz! If you had held on to the ladder, it wouldn't have happened. Hey, that's groovy! Uh, wow. Well, a sight. <laughs> that's the grooviest psychedelic paint job we've ever seen. What's that? Oh, uh, psychedelic! Wow, thanks a lot. Where'd you learn to paint like that, Mr. Weatherby? Oh, he just fell into it. <laughs> <laughs> Mantle the Magnificent and Musso will perform their famous Sawing a Man in Half trick. <laughs> hold it, Moose. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. You know what you getting out of the box for? I hate to do this, Moose, but you've got to be taught a lesson. Okay, bend the saw in two. Like this? Right now, let go of the end. <laughs> Knit with the other end. No. <laughs> Very well, he told me. And now, here's the star of our show, the giant tooth box. Uh, but there are five of you. Why do you call yourselves a three piece band? Because all we know is three pieces. <laughs> Uh, but seriously, what do they play best? Baseball. <laughs> uh, who can tell me where Australia is? 
No, I can. It's on the flip side of the earth. <laughs> What's your favorite string instrument? Uh, the yo-yo. Oh. <laughs> and now, for our first music score, Beethoven 5, the Archie's nothing. Ow! Ooh, what song is that? That's no song, you're standing on my foot. <laughs> I got a love potion to help introduce a new hit. You gonna try it out? I already did. On who? Never mind. Now let's hear the giant jukebox hit, Young Love. <laughs> invention, a 12-inch record with an 11-inch hole. Oh, what good is that? It's for people who don't like music. <laughs>
three blocks long. Yeah, and then they took away your chalk. <laughs> Boy, that was a crummy thing to do. What's that? Putting Ethel's voice on an unbreakable record. <laughs> I gave the same performance five days running. Well, you wouldn't dare give it standing still. <laughs> Does anyone know how far the average person can see? Well, I can see 93 million miles. Ridiculous. I can see the sun. Oh. <laughs> giant jukebox hit, Sunshine! Hey, little girl, stand right there. Sun is shining in your head. Fun house. 